Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if there are no startup items to display in Task Manager. So if you go underneath the Startup tab, for example, so if you right click on the Start button on Windows 11 and went up to Task Manager and went underneath Startup, and you didn't see anything listed in here, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve that without too much of a hassle. And we're going to go ahead and jump right into it. So with Task Manager open, if you haven't already opened it, just like I showed earlier, just right click on the Start button and select Task Manager. On Windows 10, you have to right click on the Task Bar and select Task Bar Settings. And you're going to select the Processes tab. Locate Windows Explorer if you see it in this list here. So you may have to just click on a random process in here and just start typing in Windows Explorer. Right click on it and select Restart. And then go back underneath the Startup tab and see if that has resolved the problem. You may also have to restart the computer, so just go ahead and close out of everything and then restart your device. And hopefully that has been able to resolve your issue. If you're still having a problem, one further thing we can attempt here as well would be to open up the search menu and type in CMD. Best match, come back with command prompt. Go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And now I want you guys to go ahead and type in SFC followed by a space forward slash scan now. Scan now should all be one word attached to the forward slash out front. Hit enter on your keyboard to begin the system scan. This will take some time to run, so please be patient. Okay, so once that's done, go ahead and close out of here, and then you want to restart the computer. And there you go, guys. Pretty straightforward process. Do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.